the tray on. Mm -hmm. 1830 Diesel, Diesel Deluxe. Deluxe. 20 years mm -hmm. they've been making this tray on, mate. We could be on the moon. <laughs> we could. You know what I mean? The lunar module. It does not look like it, but it's got the technology of a lunar module. But it's got a lot more comfort. Mm. Mate, and 10 years structural guarantee. You buy one. How good's that? They'll back it up. No problems. Off-road use, on-road use, whatever, for mm. 10 years. That's pretty good peace of mind. But what makes this such a special slide on for you? Really, the big thing, it's got the facility. It's such a compact box with everything in it. Mm. But the thing is, is the weight. Yep. All up, it's only around 400 odd kilos dry. Yep. Time you add a little bit, comes up a little bit. That's about somewhere around 300 kilos mm. short of any of their competitors. And of course, on the back of your That's year, a lot of stuff. It's vital. You know, yeah, especially is. if you're going out. Yep. As far as you could go out. But more importantly, 300 kilos is a lot to get you into your actual GVM, your gross vehicle mass specifications. Oh, okay. Well, for your vehicles. Cool. It that's is. That's a nice cool it group is. of lettering. It is. How about that? <laughs> the way they construct this unit is, yeah. you know yourself, you don't want all the weight on the back of your tray because yeah, you're just swaying like, around yeah. in the breeze. And, uh, of course, right. it lifts weight off the front wheels and it's all bad. It is. And so much more wear on your rear axles, your mm. suspension, all that sort of stuff. It's yeah. downright dangerous is it what is. it is. 60% of the weight of this unit is within the first third of mm. the whole compact unit. So mm. your weight's forward over the wheels where it should be carried. They've modelled it on me. <laughs> <laughs> I've got a few spare tires. <laughs> <laughs> then we're away. Exactly. <laughs> water tank, how right, big? Capacity, 110 litres of water. Okay. And there is options for more as well. Okay. So big, again, water and power. Comes down to your basics, doesn't, doesn't it? it? Yeah. We've got uh, the single big deep cycle battery in the unit, but of course, don't forget, you've also got your towing unit as well. Yes, indeed. More available. You've got solar as well. Mm. The big one with this one, Wabasto diesel hot water service. Brilliant. Not only gives you flowing hot water, but you've also got a heater. Not that we need one out yeah, here. Absolutely. But, but I ran into a couple of these at Walhalla in the middle of winter, and mm. boy, weren't they happy to see their diesel heaters. But this would be what you would be wanting to take on a big fishing expedition. Because let's face it, you're going to load up the back of your ute with your with your beautiful snail house, yep. whack him on the on the slide him on, then hook up the boat, and away, and away you, you go. go. Which of course gives you more loading capacity, even still in your boat and whatever. It sure does. So you've got that ultimate flexibility to get off road, get off road in a very neat compact unit. Yep and tow whatever you like behind it. Might be a jet ski, might be a tinny, whatever the case whatever may be. Is, but yep. it... Tim, retreatability. <laughs> There's a word for oh, you. There you, go. Oh, you want me to leave? <laughs> no, I don't. No, I don't want you falling back at all. Sometimes you've got to get out of the elements. You do. You know, you pull up somewhere, it's either pouring rain mm. or it's stinking hot, the bugs have arrived, like Lou they did last absolutely night. Absolutely, lousy with flies, or it could be blowing a gale. Exactly. Yeah. This thing is just so easy. Whether you lift it off the back of the tray or not, doesn't really matter. Mm. You're set up to camp inside five minutes. Folder over, tropical roof up, everything ready to go inside five minutes, genuinely. A lot to be said, and like, let's face it, if, you're, if you can actually get away into a beautiful space, it's, it's so comforting, you're not cooking out in the elements. I do understand that. Yeah, it's a great concept. I, and I it's, really do. It's great for that manoeuvrability. All terrain ability as well, with mm. the adjustable legs, adjustable ladder, pull it up anywhere. It doesn't matter whether it's rocky surfaces on the moon, wherever, <laughs> yeah, <you bet. laughs> it's all over the place. Mm. And once it folds out, you've got slightly bigger than double bed capacity up there. Yeah. Lots of flow through ventilation, mm. lots of shade and lots of weather protection from Australian Bradmore canvas. Mate, and let's face it, we've got storage for Africa in this thing. Yeah. And, and that is, of course, external storage on the back of the ute or go inside and you're just surrounded by drawers and cupboards. It's, it's just very well thought it out. It is. Everything. Tick, tick, tick.